following contest is scheduled for one fall. And will be refereed by PWA Hall of Famer, Mike the Fist Fitzpatrick. I mean, you gotta love the fits. And this is a man with a score to settle after failing to capture the LPW cha a Grand Championship last month. Sebastian Wolf looking to right the wrong and get back in the win column. Pasqua First Nations. The War Chief Lionsgate Dojo trained. Sebastian Wolf going in alone, state of emergency. From what I've heard, anyway, I've not heard it from the man himself, but perhaps going their separate ways. And his opponent. And this presents the stiffest test of young Jared Rogers' very short career in Sebastian Wolf, and you have to imagine. The butterflies going through the stomach of this young man. But we have seen him, despite not being able to capture a win quite yet, we've seen him very impressive. Jared Rogers, he's giving up some size, he's giving up some experience, but he's got a lot of heart. Sometimes heart can do crazy things. And Sebastian Wolf wasting no time. Going in behind and taking him right down to the canvas, locking on that front face lock. And hurling Jared Rogers across the ring and he's looking to wipe that memory of that loss last month out of the memories of the fans here at the Rec. Remember, we're watching on Twitch. Driving forearms and driving shoulders into that midsection. Charging in, but caught the elbow. Jared Rogers. There's that experience factor just yanking him down off that middle rope, hit the canvas hard. Jawbreaker from Rogers charging the ropes. Ooh, but got caught again. And so far, all the questions Rogers is asking, Sebastian Wolf has answers for. Rogers able to go behind, hanging on to that top rope to create space, using that top rope for a nice arm drag. Following up. Onto that top rope. Nicely done, Jared Rogers. Scampering over for the cover. Just a one. But I mean, statements are being made early on. Wolf looks a little shocked. Over that top and landing on that ring apron, repositioning himself, caught him with that shoulder coming in. Rolling off the back, going off the ropes. Oh, but he got caught into that power slam. There's a cover. Two. Wolf not pleased with that two count, but nonetheless. Gonna lock on a diversion of the camel clutch. That submission referee in position to see if Rogers wants to give it up. Now just grinding his face into the canvas. on the back of the neck and the back of the head. Let's go, Wolf! 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 I mean, 
mean, every rookie in this industry, they get that real big first test. I mean, he's had a few of them, but nobody bigger and badder than Sebastian Wolf. Rogers trying to fight up from underneath with those forearms, but put down by a forearm from the War Chief. Dragging him up by the head. Feeding European uppercuts in the corner. Fitz trying to get to bring him out. But he's gonna keep him in there and inflict more punishment. Ducking that right, and now firing in elbows of his own. Jared Rogers will not go quietly. Able to put the brakes on, tried to go up and over, and that's the experience edge. I mean, that's the definition right there as Rogers kicks out. Rogers trying to cover up. That's Sebastian Wolf feeds in those forearms. Referee checking. Checking on Jared Rogers. I mean, that was just repeated hard strikes. And perhaps now toying with his prey a little bit. Ooh, another hard back elbow. Rogers favoring his lower back. I mean, he's got to be in all sorts of pain right now. The war chief butterfly in the arms, locking those fingers into that power bomb. Hit the canvas hard. Perhaps gonna give him another one. Sits out, shoulders down, and Rogers kicking out. No one's more surprised than Sebastian Wolf. And quite frankly, a little pissed off. I think perhaps that kick out is going to lead to a whole new world of punishment on behalf of the war chief back up to his feet. Hard forearm staggers Rogers into the corner. And he's winding up with those elbows. Man. Perching Jared Rogers up on that top rope. Shot in the ribs. Placing those strikes. And now looking to take Rogers for the ride, perhaps Superflex. Rogers wants no part of that. Trying to club his way out. Headbutt takes Wolf down. Off that middle rope, and he's locking in that choke. That's how Zoe Sager defeated Sebastian Wolf last month. Jared Rogers taking notes, watching tape. Maybe it could work for him too. Into that dragon sleeper. Referee in position. Oh man, he will spin his body around. Just crashing hard down to the mat. But that took a little bit out of the war chief. Cut off the flow of oxygen just for that little bit of time. That's gonna affect your ability. Charging in, up and over in the sunset flip. Out at two. The inside cradle from Rogers. And Jared Rogers gets the win. Jared Rogers with that inside cradle, put the shoulders down for the three. And he got the hell out of Dodge, and I don't blame him, but wow. And Sebastian Wolf, I mean, he knows he got got. I mean, what are you going to do? I think in a way he, he respects it. Sometimes things don't go your way. Sometimes you just get got. And he got got by Jared Rogers. And that's going to be a massive confidence booster for that young man.